Okay, just calm, calm. Hey, can you count from five down to zero? Yeah, is this on? Five, yeah. four, three, two, WTF. Get him. Man. Hey, I'm Kevin Brosh, your slightly pissy, slightly hungover host for this four minute segment. Very brief. Okay, you go there, and I'm going to lead you in to the Kaylee Cottage. Welcome to the Kaylee Cottage. Look, I just had it painted. Hey, Pat, proprietor, lifelong friend. I thought the door was locked. Today we're making the Irishman. The Irish. What is it? The yes. Irish Manhattan. They got it wrong. Oh, jeez. It was a well, gift. Yeah, I, I made this cocktail. How are you doing, brother? How are you doing? Good, good, good. Pat McMurray, uh, world champion oyster striker. What are you doing? Polishing the metal? Polishing the metal. Okay, another segment, please. Because right now, in my slightly hungover mood, nothing says... Hey, he's doing a lot of polishing. Nothing says refreshment like an Polish Irishman in Manhattan. The one cocktail we do here well over and over and over again, it is a classic, perfect Manhattan made with vanilla infused Irish whiskey. This is a pint's house, but I did want to have one decent cocktail on the menu for when people like Pat's parents come in, for example. They, Who they just love gets a good sick of the pints, really. Don't they, they do. get sick of the pints? Well, after eight or nine of them, you know, mind that. It is a quick and simple and delicious drink to make, if I may say so myself. Those are big balls. Those are very big balls. We're going to use... You could say that you have big balls. You know I do. You've seen them. <laughs> uh, Two-week-old vanilla-infused Bushmills Irish whiskey. We take Tahitian vanilla bean pods. And Why we... Tahitian? Because that's the only place in the world where vanilla grows. Where did you go to I thought it came from the fridge. Look, something like this. Score them up the middle, separate them. So all of that good vanilla flavor gets in to the whiskey. Manhattans are ballsy cocktails. It's a classic cocktail. It's worth the ballsy ice. And it's ballsy ice. Okay, go do roll-ups now or something. Um, we're using one nice round piece of ice, less ice, less water infusion into the cocktail. Um, and I'm really just, it's more like an homage to the Manhattan. Ballsy drink, you only really need one. This actually softens it. The vanilla infusion into the whiskey, which I've had a bad day. I'm going to go for three ounces. I don't care. It's my show. I'm going to make one for Pat or for Bill. His blood work was positive. He's now drinking I'm, again, people. I'm back. You're back. Okay, so this is going to really soften up, lighten up the whiskey. The vanilla flavors are some of the stuff that you will actually find in whiskeys and in wine because of the oak. And then we're just going to take... Where is my... Uh, what are you looking for? My, uh, my Uber bar tools. Uber bar tools. Here we go. God. And we're going to just do a small amount of red vermouth, which is the sweet vermouth, and we're going to do a small amount of the white, slightly more for the white because it's already a very sweet drink. We want some of that dryness just to cut the sweetness. This is your drink. Whose drink? Well, it's not yours, it's mine. We're going to just do a bit of that with the lemon and, what the hell, a cherry. That is the Irishman... Is that an Irish cherry? Shut up and drink it, Pat. I'm a bit pissed off today. You can tell I have my man period. Live from the Cayley Cottage, I'm Kevin Brosh. It's Lunchabout. He's my goose. I'm Maverick. Pinch Out. It. Hey. What? Well, that's in the eyes. Cheers. Yes. Drink. It's Lunchabout. That's actually very good. Ooh, you get the vanilla, too, afterwards. Very nice. Now, can you just twist that up into a knot with your tongue? I'll be polishing. Director's cut. Come back for part two. I get him to make me a cocktail. Seriously. Yeah, that's a good Click one. on it right now. Get out of here, Bill. I'm polishing. 